What's up everybody, Joe with Joe's Golden Garage. I forgot I never did a little walk around of the Jetta Wagon. So here it is, 05 Jetta Wagon GLS TDI. And she is a nice little uh, wagon. Um, she's not beat up. Uh, she's in good shape. Check out them headlights, man. Um, never been wrecked. Yeah, I don't think, no, never been wrecked. Um, nice gold beige kind of color. It's really pretty. Um, it's got a little tiny hitch on it. Probably uh, had a bike rack on it or towed a small utility trailer around. But it's, uh, it's a neat little car. It's got new Goodyear tires all the way around. I took it yesterday and had a... Uh, an alignment done. Alright. These door locks can be a little finicky. But yeah, she's a, she's a clean little unit. Not beat down on. Um, I need to clean up the floor mats. Golly, you have to press the button for everything on this thing. But yeah, I need to clean on the floor mats a little bit. I put the driver one up there. And it's still got the little cargo thing. Isn't that crazy? You don't see that very often. Got some first aid and some triangles. 12 volt outlet. And man, this thing just goes down the interstate like you wouldn't believe, y'all. 85.90, I mean, just a breeze. We'll get her out here on the road. I'm about to head to work. It's raining this morning. Golly. Let's head to work. And uh, let's see if we can get done today. The uh, Mercedes wagon um, goes live tomorrow, Thursday the 11th, on Cars and Bids. So y'all keep your eye out for it. <laughs> She runs pretty, you know, pretty quiet and pretty smooth for an old diesel. Much better than uh, them old Mercedes I'm used to driving. That's some cool backlit blue gauges. That's the cruise control light. I don't know if y'all see that. I hate this iPhone 13, and I'm sure it's just user error. But I just want my Samsung back. So let's back her out here and we'll get her on the interstate. And uh, I think I already uploaded some interstate footage, but we'll see if we can't get a little more. Mowed the grass yesterday, looking good. Let's see, wipers. Looks like she needs some wipers. <laughs> pretty, sm pretty smudgy. God, this is a hell of a spot to pull out at. Hell of a spot. I'm at the wrong angle to be making a left turn. Now to go right, it's a piece of cake. But to go left, a different story. Traffic coming from way back there. Have to break your neck to look. Alright, we clear that way. Alright, let's rock and roll. if you floor it from a dead stop it will bark the front tires even with this automatic but you know the power tapers off you know pretty quick and it 
you know, it just kind of turns into, you know, <laughs> just casual acceleration. But man, it is way, way quicker than say like my 97 E300 diesel. Um, got way more passing power. That car had no passing power. Even though it would cruise 90, 95, 100 on the interstate, it just didn't have a lot in the reserves for passing. Um, it may feel even a little quicker than my 95 E300. Um, but I mean, we're only working with 100 horsepower here. But um, the little turbocharger helps, sure does. And it has a nice little sound, nice little whistle. I was riding around with the windows down last night and the sunroof open. It was cool. It was actually pretty cool up here last night. It was like 80 degrees. And I was just listening to it clatter away and turbo spool. <laughs>
let me know what you think. I think I ought to hang on to her for a while. I really like this car for a commuter. I need to see what kind of miles per gallon she returns with my heavy foot. It's got to be better than the uh, Hyundai. <laughs> y'all have a great day. We'll see y'all next time. Peace.